before you watch this video, I have to warn you, there are spoilers. If you don't want the video to be spoiled for you, I suggest you piss off and watch another video. I mean, seriously, if you don't want any spoilers, leave the video right now. One little spoiler can ruin the whole movie. Like, seriously. Like, I'm giving you a chance here. Like, you cannot sue me. I'm literally giving you a chance right now. Hey, what's going on, you guys? It's your boy TWX27 back again. As you can all see, I have changed rooms again. Man, I, I feel like such a... Man, what's that word you call when people just move from one place to another? Is that like, um... Immigrant? Immigrant? Refugee? Nomad? But either of those, either way, I'm just, like, moving all over the place, but... Anyway, recently I watched, um, Spider-Man Homecoming. Like, um, the new Spider-Man film that... Did it come in July? June? That, like, it doesn't matter, I just watched it. I want to give my personal opinion about the movie. That's right, it's my opinion. But I'm sure most people would agree my opinion. Personally, I thought the movie was great. I mean, the movie had... It, it was just it was just perfect, you know, like, everything in the movie was just was just excellent. Oh, and it had like a... like... like... most of you out there that have watched the movie already, you all know that twist? You know, that certain twist? Oh yeah, I mean, that one got me. That, that, like, I seriously had no idea. Like, that particular scene was a bit of a shock. Like, I did not expect that. Like, Marvel got me. You know, Stanley does a great job. Like, that guy is awesome. I mean, he's the creator of Marvel. He created all Marvel heroes, Spider-Man, Thor, Iron Man, all those guys. You know, if you really think about it, you know Spider-Man, he's actually one of the most liked Marvel characters. Like, he may not be the favorite for everyone, but, you know, like, many people like Spider-Man. And you know Spider-Man is like... Okay, again, this is my opinion. I'm not 100% sure, but this is what I think. I think Spider-Man is, like, the only Marvel hero that has the most movies and TV shows made after him. Like, literally, there have been TV shows made of him from, like, you know, 1960 to 70 to 80 to 90 and to the 21st century. Yeah, I mean, Spider-Man, he's, he's, like, made an impact. Like, he's... He's really cool. Although, there are some bits that I think was a bit unexplained in the movie. Like this one, for instance. Like, who was that Hawaiian guy? I mean, I know his name, of course, like now. I mean, like, I mean, in the comics and in the other series, I, like, never saw that guy. Like, I think they just added him. I only most know what happened to, like, Harry Osborn or Gwen. Like, where are those people? They probably just, like, excluded them, you know, due to the previous Spider-Man movie, you know, The Amazing Spider-Man 2. I th they just wanted to go a bit different on this one. And another thing from the movie, where was his Spider-Sense? I mean, like, he literally... I mean, I saw Spider-Man, like, you know, shoot webs, climb walls, do all that other stuff, but where was his Spider-Sense? Like, in movies, they would always, like, show us, like, you know, the Spider-Sense, like, how it is. Like, there's, like, a wave wave thing that shows us that he has a spider sense but in the movie I did not see that because when Spider-Man was getting attacked like most of the stuff that happened to him it just came to him as a surprise like it looked like he he wasn't even expecting it which I find weird because you know he has the spider sense he should be able to detect most of that stuff oh man it's a shame like of him and you know Liz not getting together I mean in the movie I mean they didn't even kiss because I saw a trailer of spider Ugh. In the trailer of Spider-Man Homecoming, yeah, it shows them kissing. And I've just been waiting for that scene, like, when did they kiss? I mean, they didn't even hold hands, they even dance with each other in that prom. You see, this is what I think should have happened. Like, I think he should have, like, just danced with her a bit in the prom scene, you know, to see if they click, and then at the end he just realizes, like, hold on, wait a minute, I can't do this. I mean, that prom scene was so quick. Like, it was so quick. Like, seriously. Oh, but wait, there's more! And also, what up with the Black Shocker? I mean, don't get me wrong, I wouldn't actually mind the Black Shocker, but in the original Shocker, he, he was white. Like, duh, like why? It's kind of like what they do with Electro in Amazing Spider-Man 2. They made him black. I don't get that. Again, don't mind, but just stick to the comic. And also when I found out that Zendaya was Mary Jane, I'm just like, are you serious? I mean, I mean, Mary Jane, in the comics, she had red or ginger hair. Not hair like Zendaya's. Again, don't mind if Zendaya's in the movie, but still, like, 
Never mind. Yeah, but overall, minus the two errors that I mentioned, it was an okay movie. No, what am I saying? It was a good movie. Yeah, and Tony Stark as well. Like, the guy who played Tony Stark, yeah, that was, uh, that was pretty good. I mean, it had so much action and so much comedy as well. Because, you know, those are two of my favorite things. Action, comedy, what more can you ask for? Of a scale of 1 to 10, how I would rate the movie? I would rate it... Again, this is my opinion. A 9.5. Yeah, 9.5. I think that's an okay score to give it to it. I mean, I even watched it twice. I mean, I didn't want to, but... You know, I had to watch it, you know, because my cousin had seen it, so... I just watched it with him. So, uh, yeah, pretty much. Please like, subscribe, have a good day. Peace out. When he jumps, sly at DJ Khaled, said you this letter, yeah. He's suing me, yeah, for doing what? For seen his latest vid that is on YouTube. He's, he's upset, so he's a prick, whoa. Watch your language, this video's rated PG. I don't give a crap, how could he do this to me? I'm gonna go out and find that cry, baby Don't do it, sir You're gonna get arrested I don't care I'm gonna go find Khaled Don't get in my way, okay, though